Well, how do the chums? Tis I, Captain of the Steves, and I'm back doing another fishing video. I'm going to try and catch all fish inside of the barren star system. Now that I only have a couple of biomes remaining, I found it a lot harder to find this one. I will be giving coordinates for this planet, and it has got activated resources on the planet. Activated idiom, so we're going to get a lot of storms. So it makes it easier to catch those storm fish that might be on this planet. Right, I'm going to start at the deepest area, I think. I'm going to start up deepest. Actually, let's do it the other way around. Let's start shallowest. Okay, so we're going to go for, oh, just here, my little man-made island. Cool. And 0 0.5 views. Okay, cool. Well, let's, um, let's get the old rod in the water, shall we, anyway? I've got the shadow law at the moment. I'm just going to go for common fish, just while we have a look what's available here. There you go, we'll do a bit of dredging, and we'll see if we can get some common fish out of here. Just check the depth. And it's not giving me the depth, I've recast. Hey ya! Still not giving me the depth, come on. It's a little bit squiffy. Yeah! It was working when I made this dang thing. Dang it! One sec. Well, it's not showing a depth, but it's it's about 0 0.5 views. It's super, super shallow. You can see it's super shallow, so it doesn't really matter. Oh, my days. I just caught a rare. Straight off the freaking bat. Okay, arid and hostile golden urchin. All right, well, we keep at it. We'll get the old No Man's Sky Assistant app, and we'll take a look what else is here inside a small, shall we? No Man's Sky Assistant app. Go down to fishing. Well, it looks quite cool now. I'm going to here. Fishing locations. It's still a work in progress, hence why we're still testing it as being the Patreon backers as his guinea pigs. And uh, Baron. You can't just put this straight out to everybody because they get poor reviews. It's still a work in progress. So we've got we've managed to get that star bound starfish already, people. The hardest one to get in here is the fragile Ithaca scale. And that one I'm gonna have to use like a bionic law for. There's also one here that can only be caught in storms called the briny worm. So yeah, when a storm kicks in, I put on the actual uh, storm float and we'll see if we can catch that one. All right, well, let's get to it. Let's see if we can catch a couple of comments. You know what, let's go for the bionic law. Let's go for that real cool one inside of this area. So boom, put on that, let's start fishing. When a storm rolls in, I'll swap over to the Magna Pulse. So what I'm going for right now is a Fragile Itacuth or something. We just got the Fool's Goldfish, which is a common, and it is it is for this uh, region, so that's good. It's finally showing the depth now. 0.4 U's right now. I know it says 0.5, but there we go. Looks like we've got a couple of medium holograms at the moment. Oh, here we go. Medium-sized legendary jellyfish. Don't need it. Don't want it. But yeah, quite cool. Oh yeah, this is the uncommon. Nice. Shell-bound starfish, limited to the hostile habitats. Lovely, we got him. Nice. We caught the legendary, we got him. Small, legendary. So I think the only real ones I need to get out of here now are real common ones. So I might as well take the bait off for a bit. Do a bit more dredging. I think there's one common that I haven't got yet. Let's have a quick look. So we go back. Yeah, we need to get the lesser dust fin. The lesser dust fin. Oh, we've got a storm coming. Cool. So, inside of storms, there is this a briny worm that I need to catch. So let's get the pole, the magna pulse on. Oh, we've got a pond skipper. I thought we might have got the other common that I needed then. Nope. But you know what? Sometimes using the Magna Pulse, because it doesn't attract legendaries, sometimes I catch the really, really shitey fish anyway. So there we go. Let's see how we get on. The numbers in the bottom have gone red, so it's now in a storm. Let's see if we get him. Now, I've been hit up by Eugene. Eugene Carr is having real problems with this briny worm. In fact, this is the last fish he has to catch to complete his whole catalogue, to complete fishing. So if I catch it, I think it's going to be a little bit jealous. Oh, we got a, a chow scale nibbler. Okay, fair enough. Well, we do need it it's for this system. Anyway, we better get casting quite quickly. Make use of this storm as much as we can. Oh, I've gone up to 65 views somehow. Okay, get it back out, out, back out of there. Cast closer. 
We need to be in the shallows. Hopefully that's in the shallows. Hopefully it's registered as shallow. It's not showing the depth anymore. There's a little bit of a khaki pond I've made. I need to make a better pond. I couldn't find any islands. Normally I make one on an island. It's nice and easy to make a little pond on an island that's already there. And it's usually quite flat too. This one's all over the place. I'm getting knocked off of it in a bit from this storm probably. We got it! We got the briny worm! There you go! Eugene Carr, I would suggest coming to this planet where storms are frequent and fish this little pond that I've made. Do exactly what I did with the pulse law and boom! It can be yours, sir. It can be yours. I guess. Okay, people. Well, I may as well give you the coordinates to this planet. So in the bottom left-hand corner there, there it is. And it's inside of Euclid. It's inside the 905 as well. My own hub area of space. Enjoy. Yeah, share it if you want. Oh, well, jumps. I've caught a message in a bottle. But not only that, I also caught some junk. Look, I've got some junk technology. That's my first piece of junk technology. So that's pretty cool. Completed my catalogue bit by bit. Let's have a look what it looks like. Uh, HP balancer. Let's stick it in. Hmm. Seems not too bad for a bit of junk. I can stay there for now, I suppose. All right, we've also got a message in a bottle. Let's have a read. Day 23, the sun is shining. I only have the fish for company. It's perfect. If only I could speak to them. Okay, lovely. Right, let's continue on. We've got one more common to catch. Not a lot of cheap people. We've got two. We've got the lesser dustbin, which I've already shown you. Then we've also got one called a bladder sack. And he's uncommon. Hmm. Okay. Probably won't get that one without any bait on the line. What I might have to do is just swap to something that's not going to land too much of a rarity, but do something. So I'm thinking maybe fish with the maggots. Let's try that. I'm going to see if we get the bladder sack on that one. The only thing is, have I gone to cast too deep? It's hard to tell, isn't it? There's a pretty crap pond that I have here. There we go. It's a small hologram, which is a good sign. Good, yep. It's a small fish that I'm going to catch. Is it going to be the bladder sack or is it going to be the lesser dust fin? Come on, be one of them. And there's a tiny little scuttlefish. It's neither of them. But the fool's goldfish. We've got a couple of them now. I'm going back to fishing without any bait. Because I was picking up a couple of larger fish inside of here. Medium ones on the uh, maggots or millworms. Got another message in a bottle. Let's have a little read. If you're reading this, you must be vigilant. Do not drink the water. Whatever you do, do not drink the water. Pretty nice. Might as well ditch those bottles there. Taking up room. Sweet. Let's see if we get him this time. Come on. Oh, we caught another briny worm. Oh, that's because there's a storm going right now. And that was on no bait at all. There you go. There you go, Eugene, just to rub it in. I caught it without any bait on. See, what I'm thinking is I could go up to the medium fish. Because there's a good chance of still catching the small fish with the medium anyway. So, could do that, I suppose. Oh, no. I mean, knocked about because of the storm. Oh, yeah. I mean, that does happen a lot on this planet because of the storms. Oh. We just caught a large fish. Okay. We caught a manta ray. That was, that was a turn up for the books, wasn't it? Okay, yeah. So, I might head in. We might fish the medium area. So, that's 25 views. Let's go into the mediums, then. And let's start fishing here. Let's see how we get on. We can always go back to the small fish and finish those last, perhaps. Ah, oh, looks like Santos, that's Eugene, has just entered the system. So I guess he's coming here to catch that fish. I might be able to just give him a briny worm out of my inventory when he gets here. I wonder if that'll work for him. We'll see. Got it. Lovely job. I was thinking I could probably invite him to my group. If he's got a headphones, I might be able to talk to him. Give it a try. Right, so Eugene's with me. I'm going to try giving him one of these. So let's um, pick it up. It's half my stack, and because I've got two, I'll give one to him. There you go. Let us know if that completes your catalogue for you, or whether it stays greyed out. I hope it works. I mean, people have told me this doesn't work, but um, yeah, might as well try it and test it and let you guys know for sure. Yeah, no, it's it's saying greyed out. Still greyed out. Okay, well, if you want to catch that fish, I caught him in here at 0 0.5 views. Well, it was probably about 0. Point, ah, yeah, in here, where I am now. In there. And you need to wait until a storm rolls in. So you might be here a little while for a storm, but they, they come quite frequently. 
about every 15 minutes or so and then just use the mag mag pulse law fantastic thank cool. you sir sweet all right well i might just leave group because i'm doing a bit of recording and um in fact i'm gonna go see ivy because my weekend here and i'll try and catch all the rest of the fish is that that's the only one you need isn't it santos that's the only one i need and uh by the way that's quite a story with those 17 uh well, notes i've gotten so far i'll i'll send them on to you when i get to figure out where this story is going well i hit up that bomber boy and he sent me every single text for every single bottle and there are some interesting ones in there. There's a lot that warn not to drink the water and warning of some sort of entities that live deep in the sea. Yeah, kind right. of weird. Yeah, so. Yeah, yours is not alone. There's a lot of weird ones. So, yeah, thanks for that, though. Thanks for the heads up. Well, have a good day, my captain. Cool. We'll I'm gonna, see you later. I'm going to drop off. Feel free to build a base. Just build it a little way away from mine. If you want to emulate what I've done here, make other fishing holes for other people, up to you. But if not, just enjoy your fishing, mate. Yes, sir. Have a good one. See you later. Say hello to Ivy. Will do. Bye, mate. Bye, mate. Cool. I went back to fishing with no bait at five, even with 0 0.5 use. And I've caught an old boot. Thank you. Pretty darn sweet. Okay, well, let's carry on. It's not a fish, but it's still cool. Okay, so chums, what I might do is jump up to medium and go for the Titan Lava. I think I said this yesterday. It's another day, so I've slept since what I said yesterday. But yeah, I'm going to go indoors because there's a storm coming anyway. And I'm going to go up to my medium sized one, which is 25 over here. And we're going to be fishing that. And you know what? I might as well put on the Bionic Law. So here we go. My law. I think I did say that I was going to do this yesterday, to be fair. Because hopefully, as I'm trying to catch the medium fish, hopefully I'm going to come across some of those smaller common fish anyway okay cool so let's stick that on there boom and let's get fishing hi -ya! is that 25 views it is nice there's also one night fish a bewitching candle fish now i have got these solar panels here and they've just closed so that signifies that we've entered into night time so hopefully we might get that that candle fish i haven't swapped to the the actual law in question you know the shadow law mainly because it's it's an epic anyway so it's a purple so you need something that pulls in those rarer fish anyhow so we'll see if we get lucky either way i still want to get that lava i want the legendary really oh there we go we've got the bewitching candlefish i thought it might happen just on the bionic law and it did well legendary but look it's small even though i'm Fishing at a depth where I'm catching more mediums, that's a bit of a shame, but at the same time, it's pretty cool to catch another legendary. I've already got it, though. Electric eel! I guess. Hostile habitat, which is barren, basically, the cactus flesh planets. Lovely! It's a shame they didn't use the actual biome types, you know. Makes it a bit more easy to understand. A lot of people have been saying to me, I'm having trouble with the hostile habitat. I'm like, what, what hostile habitat? Now I know. Chalk scale nibbler. Yeah, it's medium sized. Caught in hostile habitats. Yeah. Got you. We're getting through these mediums relatively quickly. I just caught the lesser dust fin, which is one of the commons that we needed for small. We got him. So that's good. Yeah, so I'm doing what I normally do, you know, where I'm, I'm sort of like keeping them sort of like separated out. So we go, we can stick that down there. And there's only one more we need to get now in the small range, which is actually an uncommon. Hopefully we get it fishing at this depth, but here we go. So the last of the smalls is a bladder sack that I need to catch. Yes, it's an uncommon bladder sack, like a little puffy guy, like a little puffer fish. Go on. Got another bewitching candlefish, but I thought I'd take this time to sort of explain that all different fish can be found at all different depths. Just fishing at a certain depth just increases your chance of catching that sort of size fish at the depth that we're fishing at. This is the medium sized depth between say like 15 and 25 views. So most of the fish I'm gonna pull out of here are gonna be medium. I did make a chart, I'll put it up on the screen for you now so you can have a quick look at that. It looks a little bit chaotic, um, but it just shows you can still catch even the odd colossal at this sort of depth. It's just gonna be extremely rare. But, on other biomes, I've started on the colossals, the enormous fish first, and I've pretty much caught 
a lot of the other legendaries at the Colossal Depth. So I might go and just fish all the Colossals and see if I might get the odd medium and I might get everything else in between just to save a bit of time. I usually do the, the, the largest, the Colossal, and the smallest, and it sort of catches the mediums and the larges by doing that. Okay, so I figured I will do that anyway. So I've gone to my 114 using depth. And there we go, cast it out. I need to look at the old app and we'll see what sort of legendary we're fishing for here. So if I go for a Colossal, there's only four Colossals to get. But by the time I've caught these four Colossals, I bet you I've got a lot of larges, a lot of mediums, and maybe even got that last small fish that I need. But anyway, on there is the Megalodon. Megalodon. Freaking awesome. The apex of marine predat predation. A perfect killing machine. Beware. We're after the Megalodon, people. We're going after Megalodon. Freaking awesome. Oh, well, look at that. We just caught... Oh, no. It's across different galaxies. But it was a large, anyway. We caught the Megalodon. <laughs> this is mental. Okay, cool. I'm really out of... God, Megalodon. Oh, I really wish we had an aquarium to put these in. Oh, I've got the Meg. Freaking Meg, mate. Freaking awesome. We got a bloater. It's a colossal. And it's, um, yeah, pretty cool. Uncommon. The nice thing about this biome is all the colossals can be caught at night and day. There's no specific ones there that I think are going to cause me any issues. The hardest one was the Megalodon. We've already got it. We've already got the, um, the bloater so we only need the cave prowler and the great rock tooth there we go look at this all right we've got ourselves something on at uh, medium sized there silicate crab as well lovely so i mean I, I should catch the other fish oh i thought this was um yeah different habitat now nah, it's not one that i'm after is it kind of wish that they'll phase those out or make it so you don't catch them on the bionic law or maybe they need to make a biome lot law or something so you only catch those specific to the biome because i've got all those now across all different biomes there's another one isn't it oh no hostile habitat it also makes it a bit confusing you've got to really read the text to see if it's one that you need or one that you don't because the freaking icons are the same what do i mean by that you've got this one here that says across all well that's hostile habitats actually isn't it hostile habitat but then you've got this one here that says that it's across all the different galaxies i hadn't realized that i'd actually caught this one medium sized see what i mean because they look freaking identical freaking identical there's no there's no difference between the two of them here you go i'll put it next to it just so you know you can see that look see exactly the same sweet fish that thing rock fin they're the same I caught the small bladder sack at 114 years. I, I thought it might happen. Stop my hoodie on, a bit chilly. Also, grab myself a cup of tea. Yes, my merch mug. Got my own brew of tea. Link in the video description. Shameless plug over. Thank you. The left to get at the colossal range is the cave prowler. Yep, yeah, that's an epic. So I'm using the right bait for that one right now. And then there's a common called a greater rock tooth so i might have to try fishing oh my days what's that it's a large it's a large legendary oh for this area i don't i think yes hostile habitats we've caught the large oh brilliant anyway we've got to catch the, <laughs> the greater rock tooth which is a which is a common so i might have to take the bait off the line for that one Brilliant, a relic, a relic of another age, a fusion of life and stone that refuses to die. Ossified dino... Con oh, brilliant. Okay, I quite like that. Sounds a little bit like a zelacanth in our world, doesn't it, in real life? Right, so I've actually completed all the smalls. That's all seven smalls caught. We've still got a couple of mediums to go, I think. I've got the legendary to go on medium. We've got the legendary large. And we've got our legendary on colossal. But look at all this that we've caught that is just across different habitats. You know, it's, mm, it's it, and like I say, it can be a little bit tricky to spot if you've actually caught something that's not across all habitats, especially when it's got the word habitat in there or the blinking time. 
We've got another large. It's a ferrite bow fin. Bagar! Okay. Um, lovely stuff. Where's that ferrite bow fin then when it's at home? There it is there. Then go into my large camp. Mm, stick it there. Cool. Larges. Lovely. Jams, we've got the cave prowler. So the only other colossal I've got to catch is a common. So I could take off this bait that I've got right now, since it's a little bit OP. Fish with no bait for a while and see if we get the common at colossal level. There we go. We got the greater rock tooth. And that was like the second fish after my last cut. So brilliant. Awesome. So that's all the colossal fish done. Where is he? Greater rock tooth. That's all the colossals done. There's only four. You know what? I'm going to go on to the larges now, considering I've caught some of the trickier ones to get there. So I'm going to go to my 50 use like little biodome, which is over by my landing pad. Zoom. Into here. 50. And there is actually a night fish to catch here. You know what? What I might do, just so I know when it's night time, is I'm just going to stick one of those there and just uh, wire it in over there boom okay it's actually night time right now <laughs> okay now there is a nighttime fish to be caught here a twilight something and so what i'm going to do is i'm going to put on the shadow law out and i'm going to get that in ah i would if i didn't oh yeah and i'm fishing at 53 u's at night and what am i after I am after the twilight cave fish. You can see there it's the only one that can be caught at night time in the large family. So hopefully we're going to get it, leaving just one left to get, which I think is the Amantis Ray. Oh, we got a bewitching candle fish. Okay, fine. Curiously, I'm getting quite a lot of medium fish out of this hole that I've dug for large. So 50 U's on this biome, for whatever reason, is giving me more mediums. And I would like. Well, I found if I cast just past the 50, there's actually a 64 using depth, so I'm doing that slightly. Let's we'll see if we're getting luckier. But the nice thing is, now that I know I can pull mediums out of here, I could just swap to the Bionic Law to try and catch the legendary after nighttime finishes. Yeah. There we go, we caught it at 64 U's. The Twilight Cave Fish is done, and that's large. So I think, with that one bagged, I think I may have just completed all of that. So there he is right there, let's grab him and put him there. That's my four larges done too. So now, yeah, I just need the legendary on medium, and I think we're done. So let's, um, let's go into here, let's change this out. Boom. Let's put on the Bionic Law. And let's uh, get into it, shall we? Let's hopefully we catch the... Is that at 50 U's? 54 U's. Been catching a lot of medium, so let's see. So the last at medium sized, I think, is the Titan Worm Larvae. It's caught at day and night. There he is, right there. The read up on this guy. The many mouths arise from the darkness of the ocean. The many mouths hunger for their home in the sand. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. Let's we'll see if we can get him. I think that's our last one inside of this whole biome. I think. So mediums. How many mediums are there to catch? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six. And that's how what we've got. We've got one, two, three, four, five. Yes. This is the last one that we need. Wish me luck. Another observation with this biome, this barren biome, I don't think there was a single fish that likes to be caught in the day. There was two that like to be caught nocturnally in the night. And I think this base, just by sheer luck, has got quite a decent day-night cycle. It turns to night readily fast. And we've got another one of these twilight cave fish right there. Pretty nice. Okay. This last one, I've gone back to my 25 view hole. I, I tend to get more mediums and smalls here. Um, in the other one, I was getting mediums and larges. So, there we go. Hopefully this is going to be mediums and smalls, but more leaning towards the medium size. Let's see what the first fish is that I pull out of here. 
Ah, it looks like a small hologram that's attacking it right now. Uh, I think we're going to get a small. Yeah, it's a small. Go. Cool. Chums, we've got it. We got it. We got the Titan worm larvae. That's this whole biome done. So I started this yesterday. I must have been doing it for about, I don't know, 30 to 40 minutes. I just built the base and then tried to catch all the smalls. Met up with Eugene. Logged off. Yeah, Santos in game. But uh, there we go. And then I was here for about, I'd say, another hour this morning before I started work. I've just finished my morning tea. I'm just about to go on my morning call. Brilliant. Freaking awesome. Lovely jobs. <laughs> I'm so glad. Normally this takes me up into my tea break or, or I have to finish it up in my lunch break. But no, today, got it done before days started. Heck yeah, pretty proud of myself. Okay, anyway, let's um head on over into here. Got another 10 minutes for my morning call. So we've got this guy here, Titan Worm Larvae. Stick that down there. And that's the completed set. Let's just double check inside the catalogue that it truly is completed. Because, yeah, maybe I'm just getting better, better at fishing. Maybe my luck was just better. Who knows? Okay, so I'm looking for the ones that I've just managed to catch. So, yeah, let's... Um, try and spot them amongst these to find out where i am on this board warty hogfish deep water angler no lesser dust fin that's one that was one hostile habitats this is where it started the fool's goldfish lesser dust fin and we've completed that whole page now brilliant there's the megalodon there there's no grayed out no that's actually caught caught twice brilliant okay we're doing quite well. We've, we've still got these two to catch and the sea sponge as well. All right. OK, well, we're doing good. We're doing good, people. Excellent. Eh? So what is this one? The oil fin. OK, scorched wells. I think we've only got the scorched biome left to go. I think it is just the scorched biome left. One more biome, maybe, people. Yes. One biome left, and it's the Scorched Biome. We'll be doing that next time, people. Until next time, goodbye, goodbye, and goodbye again. Death is deep, death.